Mystery as this bizarre 15 foot creature with flippers and fur washes up on a UK beach. As you can see, it's a mishmash of various animals from what the witnesses that were strolling on the beach said. It looks like an animal that was trying to give birth to another animal that's attached to it by an umbilical cord. Someone else said that it looks like a whale that's given birth to a horse that's giving birth to something else. And nobody knows what this is. 15 long, well, it's, they, it's a sea beast because it came was washed up on the beach, so it came out of the water. It's been compared to a washed up mammoth and an alien, and it's left locals mystified after turning up on a British beach. And the creature was spotted on the Merseyside beach, Liverpool, on Wednesday. It's been dubbed the Ainsdale Anomaly. People have been unable to identify this animal, which has no identifiable head, but is furry and has flippers. It's badly decomposed and is covered in flies. Now, uh, I'll leave a link below for you. This is on Daily Mail. But uh, it seems that he, I don't know if it has tusks or ribs sticking out, or maybe it's a combination of various animals. Uh, it was badly decomposed. Looks like there were three big mounds of bodily areas, all slightly different and unidentifiable to me, said one person. To me, the body looked quite twisted with flaps of skin here and there. And I'll leave a link below. Daily Mail has a lot of uh, pictures for you to see from Penn News. No identifiable head, which was strange, possibly was underneath. What I believe to be rib bones were sticking out on the top side of it. it looked like there was a large spine. It seems to me that the vertebrae were showing through the skin. Marine biologists at the University of Liverpool have been contacted for comment. When photos of the creature were shared online, people guessed that it was once a walrus, a cow, a horse, a donkey, among other stranger suggestions. Anyway, if you have any idea of what it is, please leave a comment. And this is on WND and, and Daily Mail UK. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media, and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.